Okay, so the question I chose was, what is artificial selection, and how does it differ from natural selection? So artificial selection is also known as selective breeding, and this is the process of breeding only the living organisms with desirable traits. This has been used by humans for thousands of years to preserve favorable traits in their pets, crops, livestock. Um, and this is in hopes to produce offspring that have these traits as well. <coughs> so the history of artificial selection. Darwin was the first to use this term, and he used artificial to distinguish it from natural selection. Um, in the 19th century, a popular hobby was pigeon keeping. So pigeons were selectively bred to improve their speed, endurance, homing instinct, and beauty. And all the different pigeons can be traced back to rock pigeons. So Darwin used this idea of artificial selection to support his theory of evolution by natural selection. However, he's not the first person to use artificial selection because it can be traced back to ancient Romans and Greeks who bred their strongest animals to do agricultural work or for use in war. Now on to examples of artificial selection. So the first one is dog breeding. So the wolf is the ancestor of the domestic dog. And dogs have been selectively bred for hunting, herding, companionship, etc. And now there are so many different breeds of dogs. <coughs> However, dogs now are less fit than their ancestors for living in the wild because the traits they were bred with weren't usually picked for survival. And now onto corn. So corn's ancestor is Teosinte. And humans planted only the plump Teosinte kernels because those were the most desirable traits. Um, the plants that grow from these seeds carry more genes for plumpness. So um, this process has been um, carried on for several of generations and over time the quality of the crop increases. So artificial selection versus natural selection. Artificial selection is a deliberate selection of certain traits and humans get to control um, what the organism um, looks like, what it acts like, um, etc. And natural selection, it's basically nature who decides um, which organisms with the best traits will survive and reproduce offspring. But both rely on inheritance, so um, parents passing on traits to their offspring, and both will also make changes over time. So this is evolution. Okay, thanks for watching.